All right, ladies and gentlemen, uh, the first thing I want to point out is make sure that you let, read the learning target and the success criteria for today's lesson. Um, and I'm going to kind of go over a few things and I'm going to go over my teaching points before I release you on to the sources that I have for you. So we've already kind of talked about the abolitionist movement uh, in the past. Um, the abolitionist movement was a movement to end slavery in the United States. It had actually begun in the 1700s in hopes that slavery would eventually end. But by the 1800s, many abolitionists began to push for the immediate end to slavery. Now, what is the difference? Well, the difference is people were talking. Now people are doing. And it's creating issues. So this led to the United States fracturing and it led to the heating up of arguments between those for slavery and against slavery. Now, what do I mean by the United States is fracturing? Well, you've got the North and you've got the South. And basically, many of the slave states didn't want to hear anybody opinion from the North. And in the North, they didn't want to listen to what the South had to say. So what's happening is you've got people pulling apart from other people. And we know what this winds up causing. So there are many people and organizations that stepped up to lead the abolitionist movement. Their goal? To end slavery immediately. 